Hello guys, I'm Gary with Chromespot.com and today we're checking out this very nifty extension that just got released. It's called BitTorrent Surf Beta. It's in beta, it just came out of alpha, but now it's an open beta so anyone can check it out. And if you don't know about BitTorrent, it's this very popular torrent client and uh, torrents are used for sharing files. So it is very known as a pirating service and what so on but that's actually not its purpose or its main purpose at all um many times artists you know content creators they want to share their files they want to give them out so they open license them and they send them out to people you know and and so BitTorrent and other services like it um uh, sorry about that and other services like it actually are very helpful for those people. They're peer-to-peer -peer sharing. So if I download it, if I download uh, an album, let's say that was given out for free by the by the artist, by the musician, if I download it, then I'll have it on my on my BitTorrent, and I'll be uploading, helping other people get it. You know, and it so it works like that pretty much. You share amongst your friends, or not your friends because you don't know them, but amongst people on the internet. So this is it, and what it is, it is a Chrome extension that pretty much makes your browser a BitTorrent client, or a torrent client, and uh, you don't have to leave, you don't have to open, you don't have to leave the browser, you don't have, you don't have to open another, you know, program, and I believe this may work with uh, Chromebooks as well, which is pretty cool, and it comes from, very, from a very popular service, BitTorrent. So right here, blah, 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 I'll tell you everything about it, which I'll tell you about in a bit. But if you click here, you can get BitTorrent Surf Beta. And you click here, and you, it sends you to the Chrome Web Store. So right here, you can get a video, you can get images, you can get the details, the reviews, see how people like it. Um, learn Spanish, okay. Anyways, you download, you add it to Chrome. I have already done that. And you can start using it. It's this little icon right here. I've already downloaded. And I've gone to this site. This is a BitTorrent. Let's see. Okay, this is ClearBits. ClearBits, for those of you who may not know, it's a. They distribute open license digital media. So they 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 don't charge anything, but they do charge the content creators. To put their files up here so this is legal stuff it's open license you can download it you can check it out you know for free and so these guys have actually paid so that they host it as a torrent here so you know you know that you're doing things the right way and you can press here and it'll send you to clear you can download it here download the torrent file and I've already done that actually I've downloaded this one because it's only 15 megabytes but you can search for other things and so on. And it's right here. It's already downloaded. It went pretty fast. Downloaded in a couple minutes, maybe 15 megabytes. Um, if that, I, I think it was like a minute, actually. I don't know. And right here, you can actually search for stuff. And what's cool about it is you can tell it where to search. You can add sites where to search. You can turn down the Internet Archive or the digital the default search site which is Google, Bing, and Yahoo. So you're pretty much set all around here and uh, if you search with this. So let's search something popular right now, um, Bruno Mars maybe. And right here, that was pretty quick as you can see, but you get all these downloads and I believe some of these are illegal so don't download them. But I'm just trying to show you how it actually works. You know, you search for stuff and it starts searching, getting Metallica stuff here. And that's also illegal, so don't not download them. Don't do don't download them. I'm just uh you know, I'm just demonstrating how you know the search works. Um search, it tells you here everything you've done. Everything. It's like a little notification center. Search settings, you've already seen that you can turn them off and on. If you only want to search from blog uh, BitTorrent. Or BitTorrent featured content, they got it there. You can probably add clear bits too. Um, you can, and that's pretty much it. I mean, it's pretty simple, straight and forward. 
And when you download stuff, it'll send them to your downloads folder. So wherever your download or you know, it may be different for other operating systems or whatever, but wherever your browser is set to download content to, so like if you download an image or anything from your browser and it sends an, it, you, you usually tell your browser where to send it or it gives you a default or whatever, but wherever your browser sends files, usually that's where you'll get your downloads. You can go here, you know, you got the cover art, you've got the music here, which you can check it. We can check it out if you want. Let me see. So there's that music playing. Um, I don't know, where, what am I playing it with? Am I playing it with iTunes? Uh, yeah, I was. So yeah, right there you can download it. You can check it out. You can. There's a lot of content that's for free out there. Open license. See right here, feature content. You can search for stuff and everything. And this is pretty simple. You don't have to leave your browser. You don't have to have a whole separate program or app that will work as your torrent client. You don't have to do anything else. It just works from here. So it's time to go, you know, erase all those programs. Or, you know, this is in beta, so it won't be perfect. But it, has, it hasn't given me any problems. And right here, you can actually go to the folder where this stuff is. And right here, so you can remove the download. So if you want to stop sharing it or if you don't want to have to um, download this anymore, if it was like processing and I, I don't want it, I guess I don't want it, I can cancel it here. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Plain and simple. That's how it works. So once again, this is Edgar from Chromespot.com. Let us know what you think. Hit us in the comments. Check out the written article on it that we're going to have a link for in the bottom in the description. And, uh, you know, favorite, like us, subscribe, share the video, show it to your friends, you know, share the love. And thank you very much for watching. Have a great day.